everybody هر یا خواست هستم I hope you're doing well as usual امیدوارم که حالتون مثل همیشه عالی باشه We are live again <laughs> So without any further ado Let's go for our first word بریم سراغ کلمه اولمون Our first word for tonight As you can see it right over there is Exemption Exemption Repeat after me Exemption And it's Z Exemption Say it again Exemption, exactly. What does it mean? Exemption means you are supposed to do something which is important, but you have the permission or somebody gives you the permission not to do it. Yani chi yani muafiyat? Like military service. Bebin chi kalameye? Exemption. At tu farsi sham migi muafiyat az sarbazi. In English we say exemption from For example, military service. Muafiyat az sarbazi. Exemption from military service. For example, betore misal, he was granted exemption from military service. Yani un pesare, he was granted, he was given. Behish muafiyat sarbazi khurt. Behish muafiyat dadan. Muafiyat sarbazi dadan. So, He was granted exemption from military service. It's a simple sentence. Ye jumle sadast. But I want to teach you the word exemption. Kalame ye exemption ro mekham betun dars bedam. Pay attention. It's z z. Okay, it's not se. Exemption. Bravo. Or in another example, tu ye masale dige it's not just for military service. Faqat baraye sarbazi nist. It can be for tax. Tax exemption. Yani muafiyat az maliyat. Sometimes you don't need to pay. Kho, bazi oqat you have the permission not to pay for something like a tax. Bazi oqat in ijaza ro dari ke nadi muaf mishi az tax dadan. For example, you can claim a tax exemption for each of your dependents. You can claim, میتونی مطالبه بکنی, you can claim a tax exemption, tax exemption, یعنی معافیت از مالیات, براش میتونی مطالبه بکنی, for each of your dependents, برای هر کدوم از وابستگانت, یا بستگانت, for each of your dependents. That's a beautiful word, right? معافیت, say it again, exemption. و همونطور که توی فارسی میگیم معافیت معافیت از so in English we have the same word معافیت exemption as from exemption from military service exemption from tax alright let's go for our, first, uh, our second word for tonight بریم سراغ کلمه دوم امشبمون کلمه دوم امشب هست deficiency repeat after me deficiency Deficiency. What does it mean? Deficiency means lack of. Lack of something. Deficiency of something. Any kambud ye chizi naqs. Deficiency and kambud. Naqs. Now listen to this example you will learn. For example, pregnant women often suffer from iron deficiency. Pregnant women, khanum hai ke bardar hastan, pregnant women often often or often both are correct often or often suffer from iron deficiency yani as kambude ahan ranj mibara so one more time listen pregnant women often suffer from iron deficiency ye bar dige baad az man begu deficiency Bravo! Deficiency. Deficiency. Listen to this example. Name a southern wish for Despite his deficiencies as a husband, he was a good father to his children. حالا با وجود اون کمودایی که به عنوان کمسر داشت، به عنوان شوهر، he was a good father to his children. بابای خوبی برای بچه‌هاش بود. You can use it this way as well. Deficiency. Repeat. Deficiency. 
perfect. You can say یه چیزی deficiency کم بوده یه چیزی یا or deficiency of something deficiency of iron deficiency or iron deficiency خب یه بار دیگه بعد از من بگو deficiency perfect means lack of lack of کم بوده یه چیزی lack of vitamin D vitamin D deficiency yeah you can say that Let's go for our third word. Kalami sevom imshabam khili khoshkele. Repeat after me. Declaration. Wow. Declaration. Khili tu akhbaru ina mishnabi. Yani bayaniye, elamiye, izharname. A kind of official statement. Kho? Official statement. Elamiye, izharname, bayaniye. Declaration. Repeat after me. Declaration. Declaration. You have the word right over there. Kalamarum jodari. As fele declare miat. Declare. Declare. Say it again. Declare. Declare yani bayan kardan. Masalan didi ya elam kardan. Behtar beyu. Didin tu ekelisa. Bar mi gerdon pedar mukaddas. Mige ke now. I declare you husband and wife. من الان شما رو زن شوهر اعلام میکنم. I declare you husband and wife. اعلام کردن. حالا کلممون هست declaration. توی امریکا یک توی تاریخ امریکا یک روزی هست که 13 تا قاره یا قاره <laughs> whatever it was just a goof up. Uh, 13 13 let's say states 13 تا از اون ایالت هاش تاسوت حالا جزء کالونی یا مستعمره بریتانیا بودن سو so, یه جورای ایندیپندنس پیدا میکنن وابستگیشون از بین استقلال پیدا میکنن به اون روز میگن دی امریکن دکلریشن اف ایندیپندنس یعنی روز اعلام در واقع استقلال یا بیانیه استقلال the American Declaration of Independence. Yeah, it's very famous. خیلی famous و مشهور اون روز. حالا میخوای با declaration یه جمله بسازی با make میاری. Make a declaration. یک بیانیه صادر کردن یا نوشتن یا state a kind of official thing. Listen to this example. As witnesses to the accident... They were asked to make written declarations of what they had seen. As witnesses, به عنوان شاهدان در واقع as witnesses uh, to the accident, به عنوان شاهدان اون تصادف as witnesses to the accident, they were asked. از اشون خواسته شد. They were asked to make written declarations. Of what they had seen. که بنویسن اظهاراتشون رو با اون چیزی که دیدن یا بیانیهی بنویسن که چیزی که دیدن اظهاراتشون رو از چیزی که دیدن بنویسن yeah. To make written declarations of what they had seen. One more time. Declaration. Perfect. Bravo. Let's go for our fourth word. بریم سراغ کلمه یه چهارو بمونیم. Our fourth word for tonight is, as you can see it, privilege. Repeat after me. Privilege. 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 Yani maziyat, yani emtiyaz. It's a special kind of advantage, let's say. Yik maziyat, yik emtiyaz, yik advantage khos. For example, you can benefit from the privilege of a good education. یعنی میتونی از امتیازات امتیاز یک تحصیلات خوب بهرمند بشی You can benefit from uh, the privilege of a good education Lovely, right? این کلمه هم خیلی پرکار برده همه جا هم شنیدیش Privilege یه بار دیگه بگو Privilege مس... بعد مثلا یه موقعی نامه هایی میخوای بدی میخوای بگی یا مثلا میخوای به یه نفر بگی یه افتخار یک امتیاز کار کردن تو اون کامپنی یا کامپنی شما یا توی آفیس شما یا هر چیزی انقدر خوشگل میتونی از این کلمه استفاده کنی تو این ساختار میذاریش میگی privilege to do something 
امتیاز یا مزیت کار، یه کاری یا کار کردن یا یه, یه چیزی For example You say It's a privilege to work in that company It's a privilege to work for Google For example یعنی برای گوگل کار کردن یک مزیت یک امتیازه It's a privilege to work in that company As I said, in your company از هم میگه این یک مزیت یک افتخاره که من توی کامپنی شما کار بکنم look چقدر خوشگل میشه نوشت این رو ok thank you so our fourth word was you tell me privilege yes privilege privilege for example the privileges of learning english well done یعنی مزیت های learning english زبان یاد گرفتن انگلیسی یاد گرفتن یه Okay, in جمله رو میتونم من چیز کنم اینجا بنویسم با تلا <laughs> The privileges of learning English You cannot count them نمیتونی بشماریشون Whatever Alright, let's go for our last word بریم سراغ کلمه آخرمون Our last word which I mean, which you can see it right over there is Spokesperson میتونی بفهمی چیه Spoke S- spokesperson or you can say spokesman spokeswoman or spokespeople یعنی سخنران یعنی یا سخنگو مثلا white house spokesperson سخنگوی کاخ سفید بایی تو کلامی خوشگلیه white house spokesperson say it one more time spokesperson spokesperson Perfect. یا مثلا The government spokesperson یعنی سخنگوی دولت Some, Someone who speaks on behalf of a kind of official organization or like government or whatever کسی که میاد on behalf یعنی به جایی کسی صحبت میکنه For example, as I said, White House spokesperson Okay, so one more time The last word was spokesperson سخنگو سخنران Let's go for a short review on our five words for tonight بریم سراغ یک ریویو کوتاه روی پنج تا کلمه امشب که خیلی کلمه پرکار بردی بودن Our first word was exemption Exemption به معنی معافیت هست Exemption The second word What was the second word? Deficiency Deficiency یعنی کمبوده نقصه یه چیزی uh, lack of something deficiency کلمه سوم امشب ما بود declaration declaration که از فعل declare میاد یعنی بیان declare یعنی اعلام کردن بیان کردن declaration declaration یعنی اظهارنامه بیانیه اعلامیه our fourth word privilege privilege مزیت a special advantage مزیت امتیاز privilege and the last word کلمه آخرمون spokesperson سخنگان spokesperson yeah سخنگو این بود از لایف امشب if you want to learn join and enjoy goodbye <laughs>